Good afternoon everyone. I want to talk to you today about an incredible place that I recently had the privilege to visit. Wakatobi Island. Located in southeast Sulawesi, this island is a true paradise on earth. But it's not just the stunning natural beauty that makes Wakatobi so special it's the way that it reminds us of the importance of protecting our planet and preserving the things that make it so unique and wonderful. Wakatobi is a place of contrasts. On one hand, it's a remote and secluded island that seems to exist outside of time. It's a place where you can disconnect from the stresses and worries of everyday life and reconnect with yourself and with nature. But on the other hand, it's a place that reminds us of the fragility of our planet and the urgent need to take action to protect it. One of the things that makes Wakatobi so unique is its underwater beauty. The coral reefs around the island are some of the most diverse and healthy in the world. They're home to a vast array of marine life, from colorful fish to majestic sea turtles. When you're swimming among the coral, you feel like you're in another world. A world where the beauty and complexity of nature is on full display. But the coral reefs around Wakatobi are not just beautiful, they're also incredibly important. Coral reefs are some of the most biodiverse ecosystems on the planet. They provide habitat and food for countless species of marine life, and they protect coastlines from storms and erosion. But coral reefs are also under threat from a variety of human activities, including pollution, overfishing, and climate change. Visiting Wakatobi was a powerful reminder of the need to protect our planet and its natural wonders. It made me realize that we all have a role to play in preserving the environment and ensuring that future generations can enjoy the same beauty and diversity that we do. And it reminded me that sometimes the most beautiful places are also the most fragile. So what can we do to protect places like Wakatobi and the coral reefs that surround it? There are a few things that we can all do no matter where we live or what our resources are. First, we can educate ourselves and others about the importance of protecting the environment. We can learn about the threats facing coral reefs and other ecosystems, and we can spread the word to our friends and family. We can also support organizations that are working to protect the environment, either through donations or by volunteering our time. Second, we can take action in our own lives to reduce our impact on the environment. We can reduce our use of plastic, recycle more, and make more sustainable choices when it comes to transportation, food, and energy use. Every small action we take can make a difference when it comes to protecting the planet. And third, we can advocate for policy changes that will protect the environment at a larger scale. We can vote for politicians who prioritize environmental protection, and we can write to our elected officials to express our support for policies that will protect the planet. In conclusion, Wakatobi Island is a truly special place that reminds us of the beauty and fragility of our planet. It's a place that inspires us to take action to protect the environment and preserve the natural wonders that make our world so unique. By educating ourselves, taking action in our own lives, and advocating for policy changes, we can all play a role in protecting the planet and ensuring that places like Wakatobi remain beautiful and thriving for generations to come. Thank you.